the idea of constructing a marine education center truly began to take shape here on this property at Cedar Point in Ocean Springs. Building planners and researchers at the Gulf Coast Research Lab at Southern Miss all agreed on one thing, the undeniable beauty of this coastal property. Gee, you know, this is a beautiful place. It's a, a shame to build here at all. That's when a minimally invasive architectural plan began to take shape, focused on one goal. That we would be an example of how you should build along the coastline to minimize your impacts and to preserve the quality of the environment. Now, 10 years after Hurricane Katrina, funding and support has led to the formation of a 28,000 square foot facility with more than 12,000 square feet of outdoor space. It's going to be a a place where people of all ages can come and learn about the coastal environment first, um, the marine resources that we have, but also about the research and the science that goes on within the University of Southern Mississippi and how that research connects to their daily lives. The project incorporates innovative helical piers, avoiding excavations so that root systems could be preserved to allow for as many trees as possible to stay in place. Construction is expected to take about a year and a half to complete. Over those 10 years, we lamented the, the time that was passing, but the truth is that time really allowed us to think it through, to avoid making mistakes, and to really come up with the project that needs to be here and now is the time for it, so it's very exciting. From the University of Southern Mississippi, I'm Leila Essary.